I don't have yeah, anything else to teach you. <laughs> Hello guys, this is King Cup Gaming. I'm back in business with the squad match video with the CRG. And we are here to teach him how to play. Score match, of course. Let's go. So today, I'm going to learn how to play squad match because on my YouTube channel, I mainly play football strike and golf bat. Nice. And on the other side, we are CRG Creative Raw Gamers, and we used to make a lot of content about score match, Rumble Stars, Rumble Hockey. But we started with score match. Yeah, and today we're gonna give this guy some tips because he's a beginner in score match, and I think he could use some help, right, King Cup? <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so for the beginning, uh, I have a proposal. You tell us what formations you have unlocked, what players you have unlocked, and we will make this formation and using those players that you mentioned, and we will play some friendlies against you, and then maybe if time allows, we can play some games in the arena, in the Infinity Arena with beginner players. So tell me first the formation. What do you use right now? Um, I'm using 442 because I just unlocked like okay. three formations. Okay, and yeah. tell us what players... Nice, what, nice formation yeah, for it was beginners. Really good formation. Mm -hmm. Tell us what players you have unlocked. Uh, I think uh, I haven't unlocked like any good player, but I have uh, Oliver. Oliver, the producer, okay. Yeah, the producer Use him as a striker. <laughs> huh? Use him as a striker, first of all. And you, what, <clears throat> what is your uh, hero? What, uh, what hero do you have? What type? What type of players I have? Uh, Bartos, Bartos again. Bartos. Yeah, in the infiltrator. The infiltrator. Nielsen. Okay. The engine. In the Santos producer. Just a second. Nielsen. Just a second. Go a bit slower because I have to put them in the team. So uh, yeah. you have the Bartos, the infiltrator, and then what else? Nielsen engine. Engine, engine, engine. I will use the engine in the middle, but let me find my engine. Okay, what else? Yes. Santos, the producer. Santos, the producer. I put him next to Oliva, the other producer. What else? Uh, Jensen. Jensen is also an infiltrator, right? Yeah, uh, and then... Um, okay, for now let's put Cabre him here. What? Okay, Cabrera. Cabrera, yeah, Explorer. Explorer, uh, Explorer, Explorer yeah. I will put him here. What else? Ericsson. Guard, it's a the guard. Guard, okay, I will put him guard. here. Oh, guard, guard, yeah. <laughs> guard, what else? Kujovic, He's... guard. Okay, yeah. another guard, and what else? Ramarho, explorer. R Romar, okay, explorer, mm -hmm. and what else? What else do you have? Taylor, the keeper, that's my keeper. Taylor, yeah, the, keeper. the keeper. And that's all? And I also have King Cup Gaming as a. Uh, Infiltrator. 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 So okay, so um, so no hammers as you can as <laughs> you can see over here. No um, architect or something like that. Okay, but we will no make manners. we will yeah. make it work. Don't worry. So the, unfortunately, I can't really uh, take out my intruder from the team because he's my captain, so I have to keep him. But just mm -hmm. imagine you are using now three infiltrators. So I will play my Jebe, my intruder, as an infiltrator. Of course, Jebe is better, so the intruder is better than the infiltrator is faster, but I will play him in a position where you could easily use an infiltrator, okay? So, okay. my proposal for you would be, first of all, to not use the explorers as I'm as you see right now on the screen, but use a guard, an explorer, a guard, an explorer, for the simple reason that if your opponent will throw some long passes to us towards his speedy strikers, you will have always an explorer who is pretty fast and trying to catch them up, okay? Okay. Now, in the middle of the field, I would suggest not using three infiltrators and an engine, but rather you trying to use maybe a guard instead of the infiltrator to pass from the first touch. And I'm gonna tell you uh, why, you will see why actually in some game, games. And maybe use an infiltrator here as a defender. And if you do that, you can easily exchange the guard with an infiltrator. So it would look something like this. Explorer, guard, explorer, infiltrator. So you will have speed on the sides and in the middle you have the guard who is slow and the explorer who is uh, faster. Madalin, can you please try to explain him what about the middle and if you agree with the middle that I proposed? Yes, I agree with the middle and also I was preparing myself to talk about the strategy a little bit because the idea of that middle is to try to pass from the first touch okay. with the engine and with the guard over there and mm -hmm. also try to create some space while passing for the fast infiltrators and in this case intruder yeah. but consider yeah. it infiltrator 
uh, in order to let them one versus one with the keeper yeah. and try to score, of course. Yeah. And also another good idea would be to try to pass in the wing mm-hmm. for the infiltrator. Mm-hmm. And after that, send a long pass into the box for the yeah. producer or for the other infiltrator, as you can But, see. Madeline, I have a good idea, a, a bold idea, because if you would ask me a couple of, let's say one year ago, I would say that this strategy was is the best that you could get out of these players. But what if I do this? I use two speedy strikers and two producers on the sides who you know can send actually very long passes. Or yes. at least something like this, a producer and Jebe as a striker and then a producer and an infiltrator on the sides. What do you think about this? Yes, it's a good idea, but I have to highlight that using this kind of formation over there is actually a, a good idea to try to send long, long pass from the left producer mm-hmm. to the right infiltrator, the right okay. striker. You're, you're right. As you're a totally diagonal. Right. You're totally right. Yeah. Okay, so uh, King Cup, what do you say? Yeah. Do you like this formation, first of all? Do you like this? Yeah, I like uh, it. So this strategy. So basically, uh, I will play now against you and Madeline mm-hmm. will try to teach you how to play while I try to beat you. <laughs> okay? <laughs> basically, this is how it goes. Yes, yes. we're going to have a match we're going to have in a, a few match. seconds. We're going to have a match. So I will not beat, just shake my hands with you. <laughs> Who starts? <laughs> so Madeline, oh, connection problems, please. Okay, now guide him, no, it's working. tell him what to do. Yes, you can start with a pass behind. I used to play to pass it directly to the keeper if you can do this. Uh, but I think the matchup will not be very equal because my players are level nine, most of them. Yeah, but yeah, but... We are, I am trying to keep the idea. Mm-hmm. Uh, try to pass the ball into the middle, and after that, yeah. Oh, I got it. Nice interception. So there, now but... I would pass to my producer in this place because producers usually uh, send the ball from the first touch they will not uh, try to lose it and now I will actually pass send a long pass to my in- intruder who is not first to the ball because that pass and was not yeah, the good. keeper is there you can yeah. try to pass directly to the middle if you have any few player over there the yep okay the producer you see he passes from the yes. from the first touch and now you can send a long pass actually to your infiltrator even though uh, my guard is there, so my guard is level 9, there's not well, much you can do about it. Yes. But, never but the idea of the strategy is the same. But uh, regarding the defense, I can highlight that you sh- have to be very careful there because I recommend you to not select your defenders directly. Yeah. Because okay. after that, it, they will go up and, af- and your defense will be empty. Yeah, so just keep in mind that you should keep some defenders unselected to mark continuously the strikers you see so now of course it, it's no fun for me to, to to score because it's easy to score i will try to actually show you what to do in these kind of situations so always pass the, the the ball to players like the guard and the engine and the producers because they will pass from the first touch and only when you have a clear chance of scoring pass it to the infiltrator or the intruders because they will uh, most likely not uh, not pass but try to shoot yeah? so in this situation right now i will pass it to my infiltrators i will wait for an opportunity to shoot and if I don't have it, I will keep passing. And don't forget that the producer is a really good uh, shooter. So as you can see, <laughs> yeah. Both in in. So, so unfortunately, we do not have the possibility to play a friendly with the same level of the players. But anyhow, yeah. Just sorry, something in Romania. Yeah. So okay. now I will try try not to defend. So build up an attack, guys. Try to build up an attack. Yes, you can do this exactly, and after that you can try a long pass on the on the wing, maybe yeah. if you can reach it. Reach the wing. So the wing is what your infiltrator, the guard. So you see the guard yes. passes from the first touch. That's really important. Yeah. And now try a long pass to your infiltrator from attack, but yeah. of course. So I was running out of time. So uh, yeah, take care, fine. take care, take care. Uh, watch the direction of movement that your players have and try mm-hmm. to pass it where your players will be after they get the pass you know so if for example you see your intruder running into a direction pass the ball into that direction on a future position because that's where he will be when he when he gets the pass and you will get an advantage okay so now okay. try not to rush things pass the ball between your players in 442 until you have a clear opportunity to to pa- to send a decisive pass as you see here my infantry, my intruder is pretty much uh, one to one with the keeper and the infiltrator is again a good striker a good shooter yes. and that's it 
And okay. also, as you could see, the strategy, Cosmin's strategy was based on uh, a lot of passes. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the idea was to find that player alone. Yeah. And that player okay. should have a free way to the goal. You know what, Madeline? Let's play one more. Let's mess up my uh, my formation a little bit so I my players who are very high level will not uh, be as good as they were in the first match and let yeah. you guys try to build up an attack. So I will lose the balls trying to get you to train your attack as well, okay? Yes. Okay. So, okay, so it's I will... a good idea. Yeah. Also, what I have to mention, during your attack, you have to be very careful if you are trying to send a long pass to your infiltrator mm -hmm. and the infiltrator is on the wing, you have to be very careful to pass the ball near the line. Yeah. Because there are moments when the defenders are coming to take the ball and the ball can go out and it will be still on your side. Okay. Yeah, so actually uh, what you need to take care of is even if I will get a successful tackle, uh, I will throw the ball out. As yeah. So okay guys, now I will focus on not winning, uh, which is hard for me of course, <laughs> just kidding. So now Madeline guide him. Yes. Uh... I can see now the screen. Let's see. You can start on the wing. Mm -hmm. you, yes. And pass to and the that... keeper if you have the opportunity. Also. Okay. And avoid passing to the explorers in defense because they tend to lose the ball a lot. But if you don't have any other opportunity, then just pass to them. Yes, that's a good idea. And now I think you can, you can try to pass back. You can pass back, exactly. Don't rush. Don't rush anything. Pass back to your midfield. That's right. Pass the ball a little bit until you see a really good opening in my defense. Okay. Yeah. Pass, this pass strategy again. is based on the idea that the defenders of your opponent are coming to take the ball, and you will have a lot of places to pass. Yeah. And now short pass, not there. there. You should have passed. You should have passed to, to your other striker. Yeah. So now I'm gonna give you the ball back. I, I'm gonna give you the ball back. I said. Okay, mm -hmm. and now yes. try not to rush anything. So think about it as a chess game. Try to pass, pass, pass until you see an opening in my defense. Okay, short pass now. Oh, you're out of time. Yeah. You paid attention to my, uh, to my, to me. Yeah, speaking yeah, yeah. I'll pay attention. To yeah, you. sorry, I gave you the ball back. Okay, now. So now I think it's a good opportunity for you to try to go and. Uh... Short pass. To, sorry, sorry, Madeline. Short pass to your striker right at his feet. Right at his feet. That's that's it. And now it. pass it on the wing, I would say, maybe, if you have the opportunity, or just to, to your... Oh, that's a good pass. That's a good pass. And now again, short pass. Try to build up the attack, you know? Try to build up the attack. I will try actually to uh, take some of my players out of uh, position to make it easier for you, because usually I will try to defend. Okay, now I successfully made the tackle. I'm sorry for that. So, yeah, I think this is caused by the huge difference between the yeah, levels definitely. of the players, but... Yeah. yeah, I will give it the, the ball. The idea is the same. No. I mean, the strategy behind. Yeah. So now try to build up the attack. Now this is some kind of a counter attack. And now look at your player trying to run forward. And now yes. it's a good opportunity. Go for the long post, top corner, and swipe it. No, the long post. Always the long post. Only when you're close yes. to the goal, aim for the short post. Otherwise, go for the long post. Okay, I'm now gonna try to give you the ball there. Yeah, but yes, I don't know why your uh, your players did not follow the ball. Okay, so I think now... because of the response, the response Maybe. is not but so high maybe. in this level. But let's so, see, let's yeah. see now. So now you have the opportunity to pass it in the box to your number ten, to your uh, producer. Send a, a high pass to him. Oh, like that's even better. Like... That's even better. Yeah, even and now, better. And now aim... you can try again the long post. Long post, but short, short shoot. Oh, that's. Okay, oh, I don't have yeah, anything else to teach you. <laughs> so usually from that angle, you would aim for the long post, but a low <laughs> shot. So not high, very low. But now you okay. did it. Especially with the producer, which is a very good shooter. Yeah, mm -hmm. and, and now let's see. Okay, my Jebe is, is playing really well. And now let's see one more attack from your side. I want to see. So remember, mm -hmm. it's not an offside if your player is in your side of the field. So you're okay. on the field. Okay, and okay. now short pass. That's that's good. Perfect. Don't rush. And now you have a mm -hmm. clear clear way to the goal. And don't rush now. Build an attack. Send it to your midfielders. Send it to the guard or to the engine because they will pass from the first touch. That's that's perfect. That's an infiltrator. Always uh, keep in mind guards and engines pass from the first touch. And now maybe you can try a longer pass to your um, 
to your number eight. Not that long, Ooh. not that long. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, uh, the idea was good. <laughs> the idea was good, but not that long. Okay, I will try and to. And also, I think that that was a perfect moment for you to try to pass near the line. Let me show you how to to send a long pass. Let me try yeah, to like show. this. <laughs> that's a yes. long. That's a good long pass. But of course, my my players are are high level. So now in this situation, guys. I would pass to my Jebe here yeah, because behind. I don't have a clear chance to shoot and now I will pass it to the guard who will pass it to the other guard to pass it from the first touch and now I create a good opportunity to score. Unfortunately for me I have a guard here so I'm playing it to the wizard and be patient, this is really important, be patient, send short passes between mm -hmm. your midfielders. Send, send it again as much as possible to your guards and to the engines because the guards in particular will shoot from the first touch but the engines are also good at that and now a goal on the long post easy as that uh, one so more attack from you guys the same because the defenders are coming uh, up in order to take the ball it's your and time. make interceptions but yeah but uh, it, you're out of time it was your uh, yeah, you, you should have started from the from the middle. I'm trying to fix my connection. Okay. Ah, okay. I have a connection problem. Oh, you have connection problems. Okay, then I will not I will I will not beat you if you have connection problems. I will just tell the guys again to be patient. Yeah, I saw. Okay, so it's uh, nevertheless we're gonna get to penalties yes. in this one. Let me show you the floater. Are you familiar with the floater? No, no. Really. That's the floater. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so actually, it's a kind of lobe from from distance. So in this if, case, if you are from a distance and an angle, and you're trying to shoot towards the goal before shooting, actually, you should select some uh, some of your players that are close to the goal, and still not pass to them, but shoot towards the goal, and the ball will go towards the the goal in a kind of a lob, you know. So, uh, what did you learn in this episode, <laughs> actually? <laughs> I learned like how to, you know, pass to my players and I have to focus more on passing with their producer yeah. and the, the engine because exactly. I don't want to take my ball yeah. back passing to the guards because my defense was not really good, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, the players... It's a good start. They're yeah, always see. going for the top corner. Top corner, top yeah. corner. Yeah. yeah. So again, there are some players that dribble, there are some players who pass from the first touch. Those players that pass from the first touch are really important to build up the play be patient and when you have the opportunity this just throw the ball towards your infiltrators and they will outrun most of the defenses in the game so yeah. i think we'll have a follow-up uh, episode yeah, in the yeah. near future when he will be able to unlock players like yeah. protector or commander on, and i and would so love on. to see you play in the arena so we should watch you playing in the arena but for now i think yes. it's uh, it's pretty much enough yeah, it's a good start, actually. Yeah, it's a good start. So, guys, if you've enjoyed this video, uh, don't forget uh, all the links to both channels will be down there in the description. It's going to be the same video in both channels. So, follow King Cup Gaming, follow CRG, uh, learn how to play a lot of beautiful games. Uh, yes. Any last words from your side, man? No, probably. Thank you guys so much because I'm trying to get better in squad merch. And then I yeah. have you guys to help me. Yeah, thank you so much. Yeah, it's, yeah. It was our pleasure. It so was our pleasure. thank you also for the collaboration. So guys, if you want to play uh, football strike or golf battle, golf you battle. can check his uh, yeah. his channel in the description. And also, if you want to see more Rumble Stars, Rumble Hockey, and Score Match, you can uh, subscribe to our channel. Yeah. One thing again, if you guys want to get better in Score Match, you better watch CRG. <laughs> Turn up oh. the game. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. So this was it for the episode, guys. Until next time, see you and see you. And bye bye. Bye. Take, bye. take care of yourselves.